boleh tarik masuk VIP ke situ kan tu.
Good evening to you guys doing this live stream between Thailand, as you can see from the Swede Thailand team coming out from the dugout, and it's between Thailand and Singapore team A. Looking forward to a good final. As the team comes out from the dugout, uh, everyone is preparing for the national anthem. The game will be ref by the Malaysian pair. National anthem of Singapore. There you go, both sides now heading back to their benches. 
and getting ready for the face off. The hall is more or less full house uh, with more people more or less streaming in. Uh, you can see from the screen there's uh, quite a number of people just standing by the back. I'm on the opposite side. Both sets of players coming together uh, in their respective goal, having their last deep top before face off. There's the lineup for Thailand. Three lines with uh, three lines of players, as well as three players uh, in subs. Uh, do pardon me if I do pronounce their names wrongly uh, during the game. This would be Singapore's A lineup with Surya's leading the charge as captain of Singapore. the Malaysian pair of referee to ref this final. Alright, both teams getting ready to face off. This is the final of the AOFC 2023. Face off. Thailand managed to win the face off to the delight of the Thai players. The Thai bench lively and loud uh, from the start of the game as Thai players string their usual way of uh, playing the game, being patient at the back with the three players uh, forming a nice wide triangle. Finally a ball down to the corner of the Singapore half. However, JJ of Singapore managed to win the ball back. Okay. 
a miss by Thailand and Singapore's ball. Singapore quickly played the uh, free hit and it's Ethan on the ball. Now to Nicholas Lowe. A lot of space for Vic. And a turn drag goal by Fata. And that is 1-0 to Singapore. So the quick high press by Thailand failed to win the ball and with Singapore playing the ball out very quickly uh, first from Nick Lowe to Vic and you can see Vic handling the ball to Fata before the drag shot and the first goal for Team Singapore Face off Thailand winning the face off again that is a very quick goal with the time 18.50 um, less than 2 minutes into the game and Singapore managed to secure the first goal a quick direct pass towards the middle but it was nicely secured by Jared ball down by Harris towards Tien Hong Harris was very quick uh, onto that ball, but however, it's Thailand's ball. Thailand making their line change. This is Thailand's line too. That's Pimpa on the ball and to his fellow defender kind of a half shot from far uh, regained back by Thailand and it's a goal nicely cut out by the Thai forward and a quick pass into the middle for a quick tap in and what a start to the game Only two and a half minutes into the game and we are watching live with two goals. Number 14 of Thailand managed to score the goal. Is Samong Kul. That's to his delight. Face off and apparently it's Thailand's ball. And back to Thailand's line one. Advantage call by the ref and it's Thai's ball. Thailand with the ball. Oh, nicely intercepted nearly by Fata. However, Thailand managed to secure back the ball. Advantage. Oh. Play by the ref, by the play is being caught back by the ref, and now it's tie ball again. Thailand playing with their usual two lines of play. And this is their line too. Singapore managed to trap and gain possession, however. Oh, it's Singapore's ball. My bad. It's corner's free hit uh, to Singapore. There's Nicholas Tra to Gabriel. Vantage call by the ref. And it's being called back. Singapore's ball. Hazik Wahab uh, on the ball for Singapore. Quick interpassing by Singapore, but however, that's now a potential counter. A uh, good block. Seems like a foul. Yes, it is a foul caught by the ref on Harris. And it's Thailand's ball.
And that's Thailand on the ball. Uh, the crowd here is getting higher in numbers. I literally have people standing just beside me watching the, the show. He say, say his name. His name is Danish. Anyway, back to the game. The, the Thailand bench is very vocal, um, as heard by everyone in the hall. Shows great support and encouragement to each other. Uh, this is Thailand's uh, line two. You can see the bulk of the possession is being held by Thailand. Uh, that's how they like to play their game. And do expect to see this as the game moves on. Singapore ball uh, at the side. Vic with the ball. Ethan with the ball now. Uh, strangely, the ball is being uh, hit out at the same point and it's to Thailand's ball. This is Thailand's line one, ball possession. I shall try to attempt to read out some of their names as some of the players get in possession of the ball. Harris ma managed to intercept the ball and it's Thailand's ball. Thailand forward number 22, Yip Yin, um, on to the free hit. A good decent shot, almost a rebound attempt uh, by Thai Did. But now ball back to Harris. And now to Keenan. Oh, by the way, Keenan's um, club it's actually Inos. I, by mistake, mentioned it wrongly yesterday uh, during the starting lineup announcement uh, where I mentioned the other club. But yes, Kinan from Inos. And over here, if I pronounce it correctly, Kam Banu. Um, he also helps our local club, Wonder Sticks. Um, to play in the local Premier League. Some of you might have uh, seen him play uh, in the playoffs. A nice nifty full work. A rather stick work by number 10. Chatting, trying to win the ball back now to Surya. Back to Surya again. And there he is, Azari. Azari from Nemesis, a well-known goal poacher in our local scene, managed to get the second goal for Team Singapore A. This second goal is much to the delight of the Singapore crowd. Now let's see if Singapore can retain their lead. You can see that Surya had a little room to manoeuvre, however, Azari managed to hang on to the loose ball and Got it on target in to go. Ball with Ethan. And now with Nick. Direct ball towards Vic. And a push by the Thai player on Vic. Vic on the ball again. Now at the corner to Nick. Oh, Vic! And attempt by Ethan, but apparently he stepped into the small goalie box. And it's Thailand's ball. Thailand still persisting on their two lines of gameplay. Number 44 with the ball, Pimpa. Thailand are very patient in their build-up play. 
as seen from the past seven and a half minutes or so. They managed to bring the ball to Singapore's half. Harish trying to win the ball back. And the foul is being caught back. Thailand's ball. Shot. A direct reset and a shot into goal by number 44. That's Pimpa. Fellow defenders of Thailand. Right, number 62. A quick pass and a direct slap shot in to go. You can see just before Singapore get their defences back into shape. They managed to get a quick shot off. And it's still game on. 2-2. Two, two, seven and a half minutes into the game. This has proven to be a much more exciting start as compared to the previous third and fourth match. This is number 22 of Thailand, Yip Yin. Patient build up again by the Thais. Meanwhile, while the Thais having ball possession, Singapore is being patient in their three quarter defensive approach as well. Not operating any high press uh, at this moment in time. But whereas for Thailand, they will operate a high press at any possible chance or moment. Pass just missed on Azari and a direct shot by JJ towards the goal. Surya was there as the screener but did not manage to get the ball off the rebound. Line change by both sides. Deflected shot, out of bounds, and it's Thailand's corner free hit. Big on the ball to Ethan. Ethan back to Vic and down the boards all the way to the corner to Fata. Advantage call by the ref so that the gameplay can go on. The ball now back to Fata. Down the board to Dawish. And finally a call by the ref. Push on Dawish. Corner free hit for Singapore. Thailand back on to the ball again. Actually, with uh, me, uh, right beside me, actually, uh, Jaden of Team Singapore B, um, having a bit of his uh, meal, after match meal, uh, while watching Singapore A playing their game. Uh, he was a bit shy when I offered the chance for him to commentate with me. But nonetheless, uh, Thailand is still now on to the ball. Gabriel trying to channel and trap the Thailand uh, player. Which he sort of managed to do so. Keenan trying to win the ball back. Finally, ball back to Harris. As now, let's see if uh, Singapore can build something up from this. Thailand decides not to do any high press as they need to do their line change as well as being done off um, the scene. That's Azari on the ball but we gain back to Thailand. Number 6 is Kaya Rit. I really hope I do pronounce their names um, correctly or as accurately as I can.
Now with their gameplay, it also means that Thailand's defenders do have a lot of the touches on the ball. And for the forwards, it will mean that they must be able to play it fast when the ball is down, uh, being given to them down into their opponent's half. There's JJ on the ball as he attempts to play it quick. However, a bit of miscommunication with Chia Ting and Singapore is back into their three-quarter defence. Both sides doing their line change at this moment in time. That's the trap that Singapore is trying to operate. Dawish trying to take his uh, signature shot. Right, a bit of a drag towards on his inside. And before a quick snapshot, but however, that was uh, not effective uh, just now. Good block by Fata against uh, Thailand's uh, Kaya Reed shot. I'm beginning to remember the, their names a bit better as well. Uh, Yip Yin of 22, a uh, bit of a challenge against uh, Nick Low, I believe. Slap shot by Nick, however, nicely blocked by the Thais. The Thailand defenders with the ball again, and then now down to the Singapore half. Harris trying to win the ball back, which he managed to do so. And a blick. Okay. Finally, a call for Singapore, and it's Singapore's ball. Line change for Singapore. Gerald with the ball. Thailand playing a lot more lower this time round uh, in a typical 2 1 2 formation. And with that, it's Thailand's ball as the ball was hit out by Singapore. Yes, in on the ball and now to the two players that did a bit of interpassing with each other. Number six, it's their center, Kaya Rip. Good interception by Gerald and now with Chia Ting. Sensible play by Chia Ting to retain ball possession and then now down to Azari. Intercepted by Yip Ying. Looks like a clean pick. And Singapore back in possession now with Captain Surya. Down to Dawish. Behind the goal of Thailand. Fata with the ball. Seems like there was an off ball incident. But play is still continuous. Nick Lowe securing the ball back for Singapore as Surya is looking for the line change. Vic finally managed to get on court. Uh, nick the ball down to no one in particular and Thailand secure the ball back. There's line two of Thailand. A bit of scuffle and it's Thailand's ball. Referee calling the mopper to clean up the floor just to remove any sweat that's on the ground. 
Thailand ball, Thailand free hit. Let's see if there's any uh, nice sequence that can come out of this. Nope, they decide to retain ball possession and a simple shot. Almost a rebound for Thailand, but nicely secured by Jared. Keenan now with the ball. Direct route, however, cut out by 14 of Thailand. That is very nice foot uh, stick work by number 62, Kambanu. Now to Yipin. To number 6, Kayarit. A shot off target. And now to JJ. Quick pass to Gerald. You can see the press by Thais again at work. Azari, quick stick work before a pass to Tia Ching. However, he missed the shot. He does, however, manage to get back possession. A reset pass back to Gerald. Back to Tia Ting. Attempt another shot, however, it's off target. Oh, both players missing the ball. And it's Singapore's ball. Simple pass to Nick for a quick wrist shot towards goal and Vic managed to get the ball from the back. However, Thailand managed to resecure the ball back to them. You can see that once Thailand has the ball in possession, Singapore decides to always uh, choose the route of uh, three-quarter defence. Good win of possession and now by Darwish. However, the shot is just direct towards the goal. Or rather, direct towards the goalie. Ball now in the hands of Thailand's captain, Thaydit. Looking, looking afar whenever he has possession. He's looking what's happening up there. The pass just misses uh, the hands of the captain and he managed to intercept the ball and now it's back to Singapore's ball. Then taking the long shot and the rebound kindly back to the Thai, Thai goalie's hands. Thai goalie number 72. Chai Piring, if I pronounce it correctly. So it seems like Singapore is uh, operating a sort of a trap system whereby in three-quarter defence, they will look to be in compact first but when it does play to a certain area, they will play out their traps in order to win the ball back off Thailand. Um, the ref decides that it was actually Thailand's ball and Thailand regained back possession. Direct ball towards number 99. Number 99 on side. Starting with the ball. Uh, and apparently to no one in particular. Azari is just a bit too late for the ball. And Singapore making the line change. With Fata in place. Dawish joining him. It's a fun. So that's the trap that I mentioned just moments ago where they're trying to channel and win the ball off Thailand uh, in the 
side of the court. The Thailand captain just misses the ball and a quick transition back. The defense is back with the ball passing out down to number 97. And he's back to Singapore. certain obstruction um, by Kinan I believe and anyway uh, it's Thailand's ball Stingham ball still staying tight in their three-quarter defence uh, often operating uh, lone forward up front as uh, seen here by Gabriel of 22 for Singapore so he's just taking the centre region uh, just to block off any path towards the middle number 99 of Thailand managed to secure the ball now ball back to Keenan Looks like a delayed, delayed foul. But anyway, it's time's up. 2-2 two, two, uh, at the end of period 1. So it was fast and furious at the start of the game. Uh, four quick goals. Uh, two each by both sides. And at this moment in time, it's a score of 2-2 two, two between Thailand and Singapore Team A. Now with that, um, we are going to go into a period break. At about 9 minutes time, I'll probably be back. You can see from the screen there's a lot of people uh, currently standing around, sitting around, watching the game in anticipation. So I'll head off to my break now and I'll talk to you guys later. Somehow, most have come to believe that the right to dream is reserved for a chosen few. Dare to be different. We know that being unique can be lonely, repetitive, and painful, but rewarding. Define yourself with your beliefs. Demand determination to be the only constant. Elevate yourself with passion and accelerate the next few feats. Don't let others tell you that you can dream. Fuel your own belief to dream. H2O. Dare to dream.
somehow, most have come to believe that the right to dream is reserved for a chosen few. Dare to be different. We know that being unique can be lonely, repetitive, and painful, but rewarding. Define yourself with your beliefs. Demand determination to be the only constant. Elevate yourself with passion and accelerate the next few feats. Don't let others tell you that you can dream. Fuel your own belief to dream. H2O. Dare to dream.
All right, I'm back. This is uh, the Thailand match against Singapore A. And there were plenty of shots based on the stats that shown on the screen. 10 shots. 10 shots taken by Thailand. 16 shots taken by Singapore. Two on target for each side. And it has been shown from the scoreline. It's 2-2. It's been a pretty exciting period one so far. <coughs> and let's hope for an equal exciting period two. Now both set of players. Both sets of players coming into court, getting ready to face off. And this game is ref by the Malaysian pair. And it's face-off. Thailand with the ball. This is their very strong line one in play. Oh, that's a nice blindside pass to the captains and a goal from Thailand it all started from Yip Yin number 22 playing that pass to the blindside and they managed to secure the ball back to him and a goal for Thailand you can see from the replay Kayarit managed to win the ball back and because of that the Singapore defence are out of position. This time around, Singapore with the ball, uh, with Nick, and now down to Ethan. Back to Vic. Thailand now operating a half-court defence. Oh, and the ball to the Thai block-off. That's Fata trying to win the ball off Thailand. A bit of words from him to the ref, but it's Thailand's ball. Thailand with the free hit to the Thailand captain and it's being deflected off the court Thailand's ball. Another deflection off and uh, continue to be Thailand's ball. Singapore ball at this moment in time. Now with uh, Harris on the ball. Keenan to Harris. Harris down to Nick Chua, but Thailand managed to win it back. Now to 97. And to number 23, Nam Sa Wang. This is number 14. Someone go. Singapore operating a high press. Um, Azari managed to win the ball off the Thailand player. Seems like a bit of push. And it's Singapore's ball. JJ with the ball. A long shot. And the ball is back to JJ again.
Jiaqing with the ball down to Gerald. Gerald now operating uh, as a forward at this moment in time. A foul on Singapore and the Singapore ball. Jiaqing with the ball to Nick Lowe. Well, Nick get them to do the line change. Thailand defence coming back into half-court press, allowing Singapore to have the ball possession. You can hear Sonia, the head coach of Singapore, shout, barking and shouting some uh, instructions to the Singapore boys. High press by Singapore now, on to Thailand. To no avail, that's a switch pass to the captain. And side netting, it's a no goal. Jared feeling to find a quick pass out, and it's now to Ethan. Nick Lowe. Thailand sitting back once again. Now, with the one goal lead by Thailand, seems uh, sensible for Thailand to operate a bit of a lower press. Uh, just to keep their defence intact. intact. Apparently a foul on Ethan and it's Singapore ball. Time out call by the ref. Apparently the board was shifted out from the challenge by the players just now. So it has to be put back first before the play resumes. Keenan's shot was blocked uh, by the Thai defence. Back to Keenan again. That's a good save by Jared. Ball retrieved by captain of Thailand and the ball to Yip Ying of number 22 behind the goal of Singapore. Harish to Nicholas. Now it's a 2v1 situation, but however, it was missed by Gabriel. And now the ball back to Thailand. Good switch play by Thailand. And that's another potential switch into the blind side. However, was missed by number 99. A quick drag shot from far and was nicely saved by Jared. Jared fists up in the air from the save that he just made. Pass down to Thailand now with the ball. Defender to defender as they look to retain possession. Clean catch by Jared. And now down to Nicholas Lowe.
Singapore with the ball in the corner free hit. Thailand managed to win the ball back and dishes out. Clean sweep by Harris and now to Tian Hong. Ball to Gabriel and a save by the Thailand keeper. Thailand regaining possession back again as they slow down their play. While we can see that Tian Hong is trying to operate another high press in order to win the ball back. However, a foul caught on Singapore and it's Thailand's ball. With 7 minutes into the game, Thailand is now currently leading 3-2. A quick 1-2 interpassing by Wasfield now to Tedes and Tedes short attempt was being blocked by the Thailand defender. And the ball now nicely retrieved to the Thai goalie. Harris with the ball. The ball down apparently to Nicholas. Uh, Nick managed to. Oh, what a big catch by the Thai goalie. You can see his aura. Looking at Nicholas immediately after the catch. Kinnan winning the ball off Tidit. And the Thai goalie managed to sweep it up. A good switch pass from Thailand again. You can see a few incidents of uh, switching of passes from one side to the other side by the Thais. That is a good I would say chemistry between each other by 22 and 19. Simple movement off the ball uh, and a quick shot. However, it was nicely saved by Jared. Jared losing the ball. And now Yip Yin with the ball. A potential counter. Nope. Thailand is keeping things in check and holding on to their lead.
can see from the screen, um, Sonia gathering the boys um, to discuss something. Might be a change of tactics. Um, let's see if there is. Uh, however, back to the action, Darwish um, just missing the goal. And now the ball is back to Ethan. Harris with the ball. Down to Jia Qing. Uh, quick pass to Surya. Managed to secure the ball. Now back to Jia Qing again. And a quick shot. Nicely saved by the goalie. Of Thailand. Thailand making their line change. And no high press by the Singaporean side. It is about eight and a half minutes to go before the end of period two. Pass down to the space. Retrieved by Taidit. However, it's nope, there's a foul considered by Harris on Taidit. Thailand's ball. Oh, apparently there's a, there's a change of call between the refs. So the refs are talking to each other. A change of call. And it's Singapore's ball. Singapore restarting the game. Uh, it's about 8 minutes, 20 seconds to go before the end of the second period. Do not... Singapore actually got the first goal of the game. Uh, however, at this moment in time, Singapore is now currently trailing by one goal. Ethan with the ball. And it's Singapore's ball. Thailand operating a slightly high press this time round. They are not dropping back. This time, uh, at this point of time, a bit of a three-quarter press. Possibly in bid to not allow Singapore to play as much. However, there they are making the drop towards the 60% mark. Thailand just trying to find opportunity to, to press it. Bounce of passes here and there, and a half chance by Surya. Ball lost by Azari, and another switch pass. Again from the right side of Thailand towards the left side. So by doing that, they are able to escape uh, Singapore's press from time to time. Singapore press being activated again, as seen over here, by Thailand with a burst of speed by the defender managed to escape the pass uh, escape the press long shot it was a very clean long shot 99 getting the rebound another attempt to goal 62 as well another attempt this is 99 again this time around the shot being blocked off by Azari pressing on to avoid any quick counter attack by Singapore And Thailand regained the ball possession. Thailand taking a long shot. And back to Ethan. Nick Lowe trying to calm things down. Good, nice. Slick pass to Ethan. Now to Vic. Attempted shot block by the Thai defender. And now Thai with the ball. A bit of, seems like a push by Fata. However, it was deemed clean by the refs and play carries on. Singapore 
regaining back possession while they are working on their line change. Starting with the ball now in Thailand's half to Azari. A bit uh, a push and it's Singapore's ball. Less than five minutes to go uh, before the end of second period. Thailand is keeping Singapore at bay uh, pretty smoothly. A shot from Tedes and it was blocked. Retrieved by Azari. Back to Tedes but it was now intercepted. And we gain back now with Azari. Back to Thailand again. This time back to the captain of Thailand before he sensibly resetted the ball just to calm things down for the Thais. We beat with the ball at the back of Singapore's goal. A double team by Vic helping Harris. However, a pass down the boards, a bit of miscommunication between him and Darwish. Thailand's ball from the push by Darwish. An attempt on goal by Fata deflected off and it's uh, Singapore's corner free hit. <laughs> Mood is getting more and more intense um, by the players and the crowd as this is a nicely fought contest between Thailand and Singapore Team A. Players fighting off the ball finally, the ball down to Yim Yit. However, it's being lost now back to Tedes. Tedes trying to find his options but to no avail and it's being won back by the ties. Foul considered by Tedes on the tie. Good triangular passing with each other by the ties just to regain ball possession. However, misplaced pass and now it's back to Singapore's ball uh, right at the mid court area. Nick Lowe is gonna take the free hit. Looking out for options by Ethan and a long pass down to Nicholas Chua. Behind the goal. Back to Dawish. However, he loses the ball and conceded the goal. Thailand again, good defense uh, shown by Thailand uh, to regain the ball possession. Ball in the safe hands of the Thai goalie. Yes, number 62 make his change. A bit of space for 23. Ball ricochet off Azari. No call from the ref. Azari straight to the goalie. However, a delayed penalty called by the ref onto the Thai player. Apparently, it's high stick. So his action of bringing the stick way above uh, the body of the Singaporean players was deemed a little wee bit, wee bit too high. So anyway, this is the first power play of the game uh, in this finals. And Singapore Team A are standing out a line of Fata, Nick Lo, Nick Chua, Vic and Dawish. 
Let's see what Singapore can do in the next two minutes uh, as they look to secure an equalizer. Vic with the ball. We're setting down to Nick Low. A few first time passes with each other between Darwish and Kata, and a quick shot for Nick Low. Nicely safe. Big with the ball to Nick Low. Now to the back to Darwish. Looking for options. Is he going to take a shot? Nope. Now to Fata. Darwish managed to win the ball back from the rebound. And now to Nick, Nick Low again. To Vic. Fata to, sorry, Vic to Darwish. High stick by Nicholas Schwa, and it's Thailand's ball. Off screen, uh, I can actually see that Thailand captain is having a bit of a hip problem. Tied it and is being attended by the physio. It also means that his line probably has to make some changes as he is seeking a bit of treatment. Oh, clash by the Singapore players. To the surprise of the Singapore crowd. JJ with the ball. Now to Chaoqing. To Tedes. Azari. Tedes. Azari. JJ. Chaoqing. Shot by JJ. Thailand still keeping their defense intact with about 20 seconds to go for this power play. And in the normal clock, it is 25 seconds to go before the end of second period. Call given by the rest, uh, deemed to be Thailand's ball. Ball regained by Nick Lowe as the power play is coming to an end soon. A quick shot and a block by the Thai player. 23 is back into court and it's back to 5v5 with about 5 seconds to go. 3, 2, 1 and there's the sound of the bell. At the end of period 2, it's a tight scoreline of 3-2 in favour of Thailand. Thailand scoring the goal earlier on in the period uh, and Singapore has at this current moment of time uh, failed to get the equalising goal now uh, with period 3 to come I believe there will be more action to come let's see if Thailand can extend their lead or Singapore would be able to fight back to get their equalising goal let's have another 8 to 9 minutes of break uh, before I'll be back to, to commentate on the last period uh, of these finals between Thailand and Singapore in the AOSC 2023.
and hi guys, I'm back as we are waiting patiently for the resumption of the final match between Thailand and Singapore Team A. Uh, up next is the last period, period 3. And from the stats, we can see that during period 2, Thailand took a total of 7 shots, 1 on target, and the 1 on target was crucial in order to get their third goal. Singapore 5 shots, but however, none on target. So with the one goal lead that Thailand has right now, they will look to try to hold on to this lead uh, to see off this championship. However, on Singapore's side, they will look to fight back uh, and at least an equalizer goal. Now, do note that if the final scoreline does end up as a draw uh, at the end of regulation time, uh, we will go into extra time. So let's see how this would pan out as yes, period 3 looks to restart. We are waiting patiently for the face-off. Singapore players coming into the court for the face-off. Also interesting to note that both sides are still maintaining uh, their current goalies who have started the game. Goalie of Singapore, Jared, and the goalie of Thailand, Chai Pring. Singapore with the ball between Ethan and Fata. Thailand with their vocal um, encouragement from the bench just to start off the third period. Drive in by Nick. Just missed by Darwish. However, the ball is nicely secured by the Thai goalie. Thailand making the line change, uh, similar for Singapore as well. Thailand still maintaining possession of the ball. Singapore operating a higher press as shown by Surya and Azari. However, not really pressing it hard as they are aware of Thailand's ability to play out very quickly. Now ball in the hands of 44. A bit of double team, however, foul considered by Singapore and it's Thailand's free hit. Line change by both sides. Uh, also, good to know that Tidit is actually out of the game. I can see him uh, pretty animated at the sidelines, giving out some instructions to his uh, teammates on court. Can see he's struggling. Um, he's using his stick uh, almost like a support. A shot from Thailand. However, uh, misses the goal. Ball now with Nick Law to Singapore. Loud cheer by the Singapore crowd to cheer on Team Singapore as they look to get the equalizing goal. DJ being patient with the ball. Ball out to Nicholas Shaw behind the goal to Harris 
field attempt shot. Bit of a loose ball and it was deemed as a high stick foul by Nicholas Shua. And it's Thailand's ball. Nicholas Shua attempting to play the ball quick uh, to Syria, but Thailand managed to get the ball. It looks like a counter. A quick clearance by Jia Ching. Now in the hands of Nicholas Shua. Ball out to Surya. Finding Jia Ching, however, that is an awesome save by the Thai goalie. And now ball possession into number 44 of Thai. And that's a push on Thai. Seems like he's struggling a bit. He managed to pick himself up and it's Thailand's ball. <laughs> Bill Scuffle at the back of Singapore goal. Seems like a push, however, it's deemed 50 50 by the refs. Play continues. Finally, a whistle-blown call. Dawish is down. As you can see from the screen. I believe that's Fatah that is being uh, carried off the court. Referee uh, pointing a free hit for Singapore. JJ now with the ball. Down to Azari. Azari resetting, resetting it to JJ and Haris now switching it to the other side. Thailand pinning it down so that Singapore cannot advance the ball. A bit of a loose ball. Advantage play caught by the ref and it's Thailand's ball as some of them makes their line change. Good switch play off to number six, Kari. Singapore with the ball right now. Uh, a bit of space for Vic in the centre. Down to Dawish, almost like the first goal scored by Singapore. However, this time round it was from Vic to Dawish, but he misses the target. Ball to Thailand. Uh, a bit uncanny from uh, the Thais as they loses the ball. The second ball was in and therefore a bit of delay. Dawish a quick attempt but ever managed to be secured by the Thai goalie. Thai goalie quick throw off to the front. 99 pinning down by Singapore. Tian Hong failed to find his feet properly as he could not secure the ball. And it's Singapore's ball. So you can see that Singapore is putting more and more pressure whenever there's a chance to give the high press against the ties in order to win the ball back quickly. Azari with the ball at the corner. Now to JJ. And a quick shot from JJ and to the safety hands of the Thai goalie. 
Nicely played by 62. It seems like number 62 from a defender's position, Kambanu. Uh, he has been playing more in the advanced role. Yep, Yin with the quick snapshot. Nicely saved by Jared. And his usual fist palm in the air after a good save by Jared himself. He turned to Nick Noh. Back to Ethan. Big to Ethan. Tawish. Oh, Singapore loses the ball. Yip Ying attempted shot, but it was blocked by Nick Law, and it's Thailand's ball. Quick snapshot by 62. But it was off target. Thailand's ball, 99. Uh, again, another quick snapshot. Thailand managed to secure the ball after a bit of a messy play, but now in the hands of Nicholas Chua, it seems a bit of a push by the Thai player on Nicholas Chua. And it's Singapore's ball. Now, seven minutes have passed uh, in this third period. 13 minutes to go, and Singapore is still trailing by one goal. Uh, with a scoreline of three goals to two uh, in Thailand's favour. Ethan with the free hit, and now to Nick Lowe. You can see that Thailand is operating a lot more lower press um, as the game goes by. Just allowing Singapore to have a bit of ball possession in their own half. However, the aggression does come in as seen from the screen right now uh, in order to win the ball back when the ball is being played into their area. Thailand still keeping their mood high, spirits high. Over here, Singapore into Singapore's half. JJ with the ball. To Haris. No call by the ref as the Thais got the ball back. Uh, after a few moments of uh, question mark, uh, apparently it's Thailand's ball. Board pass down, however, being stopped by Haris. Thailand's ball. The referee bring the play back. Forty-four with the ball. Forty-four pimpa. Ooh, that was a wicked deflection, which almost can end up a goal against Singapore. Starting a nice dink of the ball. And now to number 10 of Thailand. Quick shot off. Uh, and that actually allowed Thailand to do their line change. No push call by the ref. Finally a call. And instead the push is caught against Singapore on Thailand.
that was to the displeasure of the Singaporean crowd. Ball down to Yimin, but nope, back to ball back to Thailand. Nice switch of a pass. Another switch it back. Two now to the center, back to the side, and then now they smoothly played it into Singapore's half. The call is has been overturned and is gone against Thailand. Surya is pretty animated by the looks of it. Uh, trying to talk about an incident that he has seen in which he felt the referee, referee has not. So, the Singaporean players Okay, they finally stopped uh, the debate as the referee keeps hold of his decision. Anyway, Singapore's ball And Thailand back into their half-court defence. Switching in play to JJ, however, nice block by the Thai defender. Number 29. Number 29, Chum Mark. Nicholas Chua with the ball. And it's Singapore's ball. You can see the challenges are coming hard and fast as the game progresses. Singapore really needs the equalizing goal. Meanwhile, Thailand is still staying strong in their defense, uh, keeping hold of their team, one goal margin lead. A rare attempt to high press by the Thais. And now a quick throw out by the Thais on to Yip Ying. Very no foul caught. Back and forth play by both sides. Now back to the Thais again as they try to slow things down. A push on the Thailand player and it's a foul. It really gets into the Singapore crowd. A lot of cheering. Uh, by the Singapore crowd for Singapore. JJ to Surya, back to Tiaqing, deflected shot. And it's back to the Thais. Let's see whether he can get the shot off. No, it was nicely blocked. And now into the hands of Haris. Back to JJ. Nine minutes to go. And the tie still leads. Good clearance. And it's Singapore's ball. This allowed Thailand to do a bit of change at the back. As well as for Singapore, they have made their changes. Uh, with the line of Ethan, Nick, Fata, Vic and Dawish. Turn patiently weighing his options that's in front of him. Now to Nick Law. However, it was cleanly won back by the Thais. Very good stick work to escape the press. This Thai defender pairing has been impressive. Look at how they control the ball, escaping the press. And now dishes out. Ethan managed to get the ball back. Now back to Fata, Fata to Nick Low. Nick Low now to Ethan. Towards the center, however, is being cut out by number six. As he's about to take the quick shot. 62 getting back possession. Yip Ying, however, he's cut his shot. 
Pata clearing it out. Back to Thailand. And a quick pass to the other side. Allowing number six to get the first time shot. However, what a nice save by Jared. However, Thai still have the ball in possession. Lost by them and now back to Singapore. Ball currently with JJ. Now we can already see that Singapore is operating uh, more or less a two-line uh, shifts. This time around with the line of Surya, Haris, Chaqing, Azari and JJ. The Another save by the Thai goalie. These are tiring times for the players who are playing in this moment of time. Right, to play two lines in such a high intensity game and a high stakes game, it really tests on uh, both, both physical and mental capacity of the players. Six and a half minutes to go. This is Gabriel on the ball. Now to Ethan. A poor touch by Gabriel and Thailand with the ball. Down the boards. Now back to the goal. Nick Lowe is trying to catch up on to the Thai player. And a foul considered by Nick Lowe. Thailand 44. That was Thailand 44 Pimpa. Doing a fantastic job in securing and keeping ball possession. Thailand with the ball now at the back of the goal. The back of the goal again. By number six, Kayarit. Doing a good job with all these body feints and change of directions. And there he has the ball again. Now back to the centre. Finally finding Yip Ying for the tap. However, it's nicely saved by Jared. Always good to see a confident keeper at your side. However, with five and a half minutes to go, Singapore is still trailing by that one goal. Harris lost the ball over there. And Thailand secures back the ball possession. Oh, and as I said, Thailand lost back possession again. And now it's back to Singapore hands. Oh, that's... Uh Apparently, it's handball by the Thais. Oh, what a miss by Surya. Instead of tapping it into the goal, he tapped it towards the goalie. And according to the stats, that would probably be a save for the goalies. A call by the refs against Singapore as number 62 is struggling. You can see from the replay again, blindside pass to Surya. However, Surya misses the target and failed to score. Would he come to regret this? With five minutes to go, Singapore is still down with one goal. A score of 2-3. This would be a tight nerve-wracking finish with five minutes to go. And there comes the mob again. Now this is a, an air-conditioned environment, right? And the mob has been out for a couple of times since the last match I've commentated. It so means that with this high-intensity game that's going on, players are sweating. All right, good job, girl. As they look to resume the gameplay. The crowd is back again with Let's Go Singapore, Let's Go. Now the Thais are actually pretty smart in taking their time, right? Just to get a bit of a breather uh, in this timeout.
game management is something that uh, players have to be able to do. Oh, what a, that's a, a snap volley shot. By number 14. Samong Gol. Uh, as he made his switch out, now back to Singapore. Ball possession. Thailand back in their half-court defence. JJ with the ball. Taking a long shot, however, he misses the target. Now back to Thailand. Securing the ball. Apparently, he hits the head of the Thai player and it's a two-minute bench penalty on JJ. With that, it means it's power play by th for Thailand in the next two minutes. Let's see how Thailand controls the tempo or controls the game in the next two minutes. That will be very interesting to know. The box play by Singapore as they send in the four of Dawish, Bata, Ethan and Nicholas Lowe. Now with the power play, Thaidit, the captain of Thailand, is back on court in bid to work something out. However, it was a shot by Yip Ying. Nicely safe and it's out for a Thailand's ball. That is another good chance by Thailand again. However, it just misses the target. Ethan now with the ball, weighing his options, a high ball in attempt to find Jia Ching. However, a good take by Kaya Rit. What a touch by him to secure the ball very elegantly. There he is now with the ball again. To Thaidit. Now to Yiping. Trying to find the blindside pass to no avail. Another attempt again. And now back to Thaidit. Tarik to Pimpa, Pimpa shot was blocked to Yip Ying again. And attempt! Slam shot goal by Kayarit. As you can see, delight for the Thai players. With that, it means it's a two goal lead for Thailand with a scoreline of 4 2. The goal by Thailand is class. You can see the switch of play as he prepare his slap shot with the screener in place. You can see 62 is almost blocking. Yes, he, he indeed with his positioning as a screener did help to disrupt the vision of Jared in goal. With 3 minutes 38 seconds to go. Two goals down for Singapore Team A. Let's see if there will be a different approach operated by Singapore. Thailand now needs to be able to stay as composed as before. What a turn by 97. Almost to Dawish, good take. Number 99 with the ball right now. Shooting the ball very well, keeping the ball possession. No fouls being caught. And the play still carry on. What a skill by Tidy. However, it was nicely saved by Jared. Now the ball with. And now it's another two-minute bench penalty on Surya. Surya is unhappy with the decision. However, the referee decision is firm as he makes his walk down to the Sinbin. 
And with that, it means it's another power play for Thailand with two and a half minutes to go. The mob has to come out again as another pool of sweat is being apparent uh, on court. I could even see it here uh, at level 3. Now, as mentioned, two goals down. This is a great disadvantage situation for Singapore as Thailand looks to play out between the triangle pair of Kairi, Thaidit, and number 44, Pimpa. Patient built up by the Thais as Singapore inch forward slightly more. This is simply a class of being able to retain ball possession by the Thais. And now down to the middle, he has space. Down to Yip Ying. Attempt to play to tie it, however, it failed. But the Thais managed to win the ball back immediately. A foul on Thai. And it's a Thai free hit again. Number 62 of Thai. Kambanu is obviously very tired from the game intensity so far. However, he is trying to stay strong to help whatever he can to see out the time in the next 1 minute 15 seconds or so. Good interplay again. Nice triangular play by the Thais. And now back to the centre again as he resets the ball back to Pimpa. There's no rush for the Thais and finally a misplaced pass uh, so that Nick Lowe can have possession of the ball. No call by the rest. Back to Kyrie. Pimpa, nice move to escape away from the Singapore player. Surya is back on court, and with that, last 20 seconds to go. Fifteen more seconds, two goals down. Thailand with a superior. Uh, two goals lead. Uh, direct ball up into the air. Now in the hands of Nick Lo. Now to Jia Qing. Losing the ball, Thailand. Thailand giving it back to Singapore, but with about three seconds to go. That is it for Thailand. Thailand have won the AOSC 2023. The last two minutes of gameplay, their power play has been very, very impressive. You can see the jubilation in the Thais' faces. And as well as uh, in the coaches' faces. This has been an interesting, exciting match between Singapore and Thailand. It started off with a very intense, quick goals by both sides, scoring two goals each, uh, bringing the scoreline of 2-2 at the start. However, with Thailand getting the goal in lead, uh, with the third goal, it switched to a more tactical manner and Thailand have showed 
how they are able to control the gameplay and from there the fourth goal lead through power play oh, sorry fourth goal through the power play and with the two goals lead Singapore just could not manage to recover back and with that the final placing for the AOFC first place belongs to Thailand second place belongs to Team Singapore A now if you missed the previous match Team Singapore B uh, came in third after winning against Korea Korea getting the fourth place as well this has been an exciting week of games and tournament for us Singaporeans uh, I hope you guys looking at live stream did enjoy the whole tournament uh, including those that are present at the hall uh, in our Tampines Hub do look forward for the next major tournament in WFC Ladies which will be held in Singapore as well come December and with that um, I will end off my duty this is Desmond speaking and with that peace out take care
ることはなく
Uh, I think today was a very close match and of course the result isn't what we wanted. Of course we wanted to have the win but still uh, it was really tight and we had a lot of chances but we couldn't convert them and the Thailand goalie played very well and we really appreciate all the support from uh, everyone in the crowd today. Yeah. So what, uh, so what do you feel about this tournament as a whole? I think this tournament has been a rare opportunity for us to play on home ground in, uh, in Singapore and for the Singapore crowd to watch us play and yeah so it's been a really fun experience and looking forward to the next tournament. It was a really tight game. Um, I think that we was like 2-2 two, two after the first period, but uh, we, we had a lot of chances today and uh, we had one guy, number 62, uh, Bon, and he was, he was amazing today. So I think that the man of the match should go to him, but I think it's, he, 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 most of the earnings should go to him. It was like a really rock today. And, uh, Jared in the goal in the Singapore was it was amazing. So it was not an easy game, but uh, finally we could we could bring the goal and uh, score some goals. Uh, so what are your thoughts about this tournament as a whole? Uh, I think it has been uh, a quiet journey actually. Uh, we are here with half devel development uh, guys, and uh, it was really fun to see that uh, in other games and games like this, uh, the younger younger guys uh, came forward uh, and let uh, the older guys just take a little step back and it, it was really fun and it's I think it's good for the future that we have players like this. Okay, great. Congrats on the win. Thank you. Thank you so much.